Welcome back to the shop. I'm Kirk Anderson. This week's video is on a wall organizer for the bathroom. Now I'll be making this project out of poplar. First thing to do is to cut the boards down to size on the table saw. Now this little organizer is going to have a shelf, but I want a little lip on the shelf so things don't slide off. So I'm cutting some thin strips to make that lip. Now the lip on the shelf is just going to be glued down and then clamped tight. And then using a flush trim saw, just cut off the excess that's going to be on the side. Now this wall organizer is going to have pegs, so I'm pre-drilling with a portion of bit to attach the pegs to the board. Now I'm going to attach the shelf of the organizer to the backboard using pocket hole screws. Now with a little bit of glue, it's just a matter of attaching the backboard to the shelf with the pocket hole screws. Now I'm also going to make some brackets to help hold the shelf. And I want the brackets to be identical. So the best way to do this is to cut them both at the same time. And that's where this trick with CA glue and painter's tape comes in handy. And then it's over to the isolating spindle sander to shape the brackets. Now I pre-drilled to attach the brackets, and then with a little bit of glue to help it, it's just a matter of attaching the brackets. Now to make the pegs, I'll be using dowels and actually some wooden drawer pulls. First thing to do is cut the dowels down to size on the table saw using my small cross-cutting sled. Now in order to attach the wooden drawer pulls to the doll, I had to drill out a hole in the dowel. And I'll keep you from getting sick from watching this psychedelic image. It does seem that the drill press interferes with the recording of the video. And now with the holes drilled through the dowel and a little bit of glue, it's just a matter of attaching the drawer pull to the dowel to make the peg. And now it's just a matter of inserting the dowel into the backboard. Good amount of glue into the hole, and then just slide the peg in. And then I'll also apply a clamp to help hold it secure while the glue cures. Now to attach the wall organizer to the wall, I decided to use some keyholes so there's nothing that's showing on how it's attached. Now I'll be using my palm router to make the keyhole, and the first thing I did was make a jig that's so I can make these keyholes nice and even. Now I'm actually painting this. Now you don't have to, you can just use a finish. I mean, you, you can also use any type of wood that you want. And I decided to use poplar because I wanted to paint it. And I'll be using my Earl Axe 5500 sprayer to paint it. Now I've used the Earl Axe before for finishes, but this is the first time that I'm using it for paint. So I'm on a learning curve here. Well, that's it. It's complete and it's ready to be hung up to hold the towels and bathrobes in the bathroom. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video and don't forget to give it a like and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And as always, all you woodworkers out there, 
just get out there and cut some wood.